Uh, to be honest, I'd rather take ten spiders than the last two three films that Mahesh Babu has come out. Yeah. The female empowerment part that uh, I just hope it's not forced. It's it's yeah. uh, organic. In play. <laughs> See, I am not a feminist, but uh, I I come under the uh, bracket of being misogyny uh, due to comedy and uh, being feminist for the respect. So I come between comedy and respect. A Jalsa movie, bhayam. <laughs> Why want to like choose that? Like I want that scene, bro, in the spider. Like I want to show the villain. Madhulo ne puchka hai, puchka hai. Like why puchka hai, bro? Like any any other fruit also it works, but puchka hai doesn't work for me. So let's chop off all the songs. We don't need women. Like being a man, we don't need women just to uh, satisfy our uh, chemicals, chemical reaction. We don't need women, bro. Just masculine rage, like testosterone level. Whatever. See, first of all, what men do? Half of the things it's stupid and idiotic. Ah, uh-huh. it's just chaotic and male testosterone levels, bro. Like our testosterone uh, gives some chemicals and we perform. There, we don't have any uh, setup and payoff. We don't have any. So we just oh, jay balaya. We are that part, bro. Just randomly. Pucha kya kosam Rahul Pitin dis kuna do? Like why? So. So hello guys, welcome to Thumbi Learns. We're making a podcast uh, on the topic of movies, like in general movies, and uh, we're going to be talking specifically on a particular movie, which is hated by uh, humongous uh, people of uh, South India as well, like whole uh, all states, uh, which is um, Spider, directed by Murugadas. So. uh i invite uh, pranav bellari he is my cousin brother and uh, he has uh, a good and uh, keen, keen interest in uh, movies and uh, he is into movie making also he made a uh, few short films as well which i like so pranav take your mic <laughs> do what hi thank you thank you for having me on thumbi learns toast uh glad to be here hmm. and uh Yes, uh, oh, is is but before we start, is Spider really hated by all? I guess so, but uh, there's a talk. But uh, personally speaking, I kind of liked it. So uh, mm-hmm. due to that uh, conflict of interest, I just mm-hmm. want to talk about it. Like uh, there are few uh, good scenes and uh, very good direction as well, but people mm-hmm. don't talk, talk about it. Like uh, they say it's an mm-hmm. uh, uh straight away copy of dark knight which i agree to but uh, it's okay to copy right uh, like not copyright it's okay to copy from others it is it is i i i don't think i don't think the problem is with uh, him i mean you look at ar murugadas of gajini it's ah, partially it's a memento or, really inspired from uh, nolan's memento memento yeah right? uh, and gajini was a blockbuster in both the languages so uh-huh. i don't i genuinely don't think this dark knight influence is a uh, is a factor for people saying it's a bad movie um uh, straight away I, copy of trivikram uh... trivikram's july uh, uh-huh, yeah, opening okay. i thought it was the bank robbery sequence yeah the joker scene it's a, it's a replica of uh, uh, dark knight uh, opening scene yes 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 <laughs> so uh, but but like um, no matter what, whether you say it's a copy or not if if it works it works july was a big hit gajini uh-huh. was a big hit so why why would you say that spy i mean not you but like why would people generally say Spider is a bad movie because it takes inspirations from the Dark Knight. Ah, uh, I guess that uh, in Spider the uh, there is too much comedy. Like uh, we want to be serious, there is comedy in it. So it's a good combination, but uh, rightly done. Yeah, uh, it will be a huge hit. But uh, because of that silly comedy, which I uh, that in category, uh, because of that, I think uh, Spider comes under the list of uh, flop. uh flop list so See, i think i think it has got a uh, couple of things number one you have to realize that um the makers of the film they are dealing with a superstar right yeah, yeah. even in 2017 prabhu was a superstar he hmm. still is the superstar so the pressure of um having a superstar is that you have certain amount of uh, people that you have to satisfy by doing bare minimum things yeah, there are expectations hmm which include cecilia cecilia ha huh. <laughs> which include the other song that comes later puchka puchka the the lyrics there ha ha 
these are these are basic stuff um let's say mahesh babu was not involved in the project i doubt rahul preet would even be there in the film ha right? it's a selling point so, not a story but a star is a selling point of the movie i think exactly a uh, star is definitely the selling point of the movie and they are not clear uh, you can you can tell that they're not clear about what they want the movie to be do they want it to be a slick action thriller do, uh, you, do they want it to be uh, a cat and mouse between a psycho killer and a uh, surya and or, uh, yeah do they do they just want it to be uh, this guy handling i don't know what it starts uh, off as him being a sp- superhero or ha and... uh. it's 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 i think i think one of the major problem was they were unclear about the zone in which they wanted to explore the film ha uh, like what they so, want to show okay. they are uh, blurry they have blurry vision like what they want to show like, yeah, absolutely as, absolutely uh, yeah as you said it's a uh, we have to take it in a star movie type zone like uh pa 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 elevation pa 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 scene pa 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 elevation or an end note absolutely or that or a, a perfectly psycho killer type genre because the issue uh, to me is uh the introduction of a villain is at the interval like it's a pre interval scene yes yes uh, that that's the issue to me like uh, i want like being an audience like watching a movie i want a reason why he is killing at the first moment like a small glimpse of it uh, will help me a lot like understanding the character why he is killing and why, what is his motive though it's a uh, investigation thrilling type of hood in it at the starting part but i wish uh, if they show uh, why the villain is doing such things will help me a lot to See, understand movie i completely agree with what you're saying it's that um you know there's there's a lack of conflict in the beginning the first 40 minutes of the film until uh, this guy goes to that uh, village where we, uh, we find out about bhairava hmm. uh, there's a complete lack of conflict i mean this guy is stalking rakul preet singh he's ah, hanging that, out with her yeah, yeah uh all of that happens and then one murder happens and suddenly this guy decides to uh, i mean the the lack of a conflict is losing audience's interest that's what i i thought in the beginning but uh, Yes see i i still don't uh, to be honest i'd rather take 10 spiders than the last two three films that mahesh babu has come out yeah yeah totally i would I was happily sit yeah. through 10 more spiders yeah that i <laughs> so, so i i i don't think it's um, if if anyone does call it a disaster or a horrible film i completely disagree with them it's not it's just that it's a very messy film uh, it had glimpses of very good very good moments mm. but could not uh, cash in much on them ha huh. Uh, what are what are your favorite parts of the film favorite parts are the villain parts it's too epic to me like uh, if we consider the whole uh, tollywood uh, genres of the movies but exploring the villain part is uh, too cool to me like uh, the pushing the, a man from the mountain uh, from a cliff and the laugh after that it's it gives goosebumps to me as well like uh, even if i don't see but i i'm talking to you i get little goosebumps that There's a scene where a small child throws a man from a cliff, and he laughs at it. After throwing, that's actually a very very good scene. You know, the it's kid a dark comes, scene. Yeah. And, no, it's it, it's not like he comes and immediately pushes. Also, he does huh. boo. Boo. And that man just looks at a poor ass. He does boo like again. Ha. He uh, and uh, and and, uh, and then it cuts to him directly falling because uh, uh, I think I think that was that was a lovely sequence. Uh, the entire uh, uh, yeah. After that, also it, uh, he'll do uh, again. He'll do the action like boo. Ha ha ha. Type. So like it's a very a cute and it's a very interesting scene to explore a child's psychic of that moment instant yes yes actually even the scene where he's born um uh-huh. there's this shot where as as the kid comes out uh-huh. and uh, it it intercuts to the crying that's happening over there hmm. and then it quickly intercuts to the ear of the kid as if uh-huh. the first thing the kid hears uh-huh. or the baby hear are the right? uh, is the wailing of the uh-huh. P- parents or the other people Uh-huh. Yes. There's a lot. Uh, I mostly I'm interested in the uh, psychology of the uh, characters in the movie. Uh, where mm-hmm. I'm starting a podcast that uh, I'm starting to understand the characters in Rama. So what is the okay. uh, mental condition before taking a decision? So uh, that part in every story I like the part, I part that uh, mental decision or the mental psychic of the character. so right and there are beautiful scenes like metaphors like uh, 
when the baby is born, when the villain is born, the first thing he hears is others cry, not him cry, him crying. Yes, yes. So yes. that point that baby's uh, the crying of other people is more dominating than his crying. So the concept is very cool, as well as the execution part also. But mm -hmm. uh, adding the unnecessary complimentary comedy scenes that uh, like people sees the comedy scene and uh, that that shows a drawback. And they don't see a beautiful scenes and beautiful uh, story of a villain. So my thought was, if we compile every that uh, villain story, it's very interesting. Like without the comedy part, and uh, the comedy part is why I talk about. I talk about Nelson a lot. Like in the in handling dark comedy scenes, he blends a comedy and dark scenes very too well. It's like a uh, like jam and butter. Like not jam and butter, jam and butter. Like it tastes good when we see it, like in a doctor or uh, in the trailer. trailer also. The first in uh, first part, it's very cool. Like uh, so, comedy. I think I think if, if he handles a very a decent way, uh, Spider can be a beautiful film and a hit film also. Like no, um, I I agree with you, sure with the comedy part, but when you even because you've cited Nelson. You look at his better work, that is uh, Doctor or uh, Coco Coquilla or Coco -Coco. Jailer. Mm -hmm. um, at least let's let's uh, I can I can talk about Jailer or Doctor because they're, they're more mainstream. Uh, the characters, that is uh, your lead characters, the antagonist and the protagonist, they have uh, while they're being their beliefs are being presented comically, mm -hmm. they do hold strong philosophical beliefs. You um, look at Jailer, that is the, the very recent film. Uh, it opens with uh, his entire part where he kills three people because he suspects one of them, right? Huh. So yeah, yeah, yeah. The it is it now the entire tone of that scene is presented in a very humorous manner with uh, the Varma's friend and all all of that. Huh. But you can tell that this guy is completely unapologetic when it comes to his own work, his own whatever business that mm. he's dealing. He's an unapologetic. And the reason he leads to Ramakrishna is why that. Uh... Yeah. Uh, if you know uh, your son is killed by him, will you kill him? So the Ramakrishna answers that uh, no, I can't because I'm incapable of it. Yes. But the straight away answer to it is I'm capable of it. So yes, I did it. yes, so yes. The reason for it is which very establish, satisfying. Like. Which, is, which establishes the protagonist as well. Now uh -huh. you know what the protagonist believes. You know what the antagonist believes. Their philosophical uh, beliefs conflicting is where the film gets interesting. Uh -huh. You look at Spider. You have a strong antagonist because uh, whatever his philosophical conflict that comes in the, uh, I think in the interrogation scene, he reveals that uh, how how can you kill uh, goats, hmm. uh, but say that killing ah. deers is illegal, hmm. right? So uh, that, is, that is the antagonist. Nah. But the same scene I, in, in the businessman as well, like tuna fish, the scene. Yes, uh, yes. That's the same scene, same moment, same dialogues, but the businessman movie hits different because of the... Uh, character development of the hero as we yep. learn from it uh, when he says the dialogue it shows something like it uh, delivers something message continue continue so yeah uh, i think i think uh, spider spiders uh, one of one of spider storms was that it uh, had a very strong antagonist but mm -hmm. did not know whether, whether to make it into a hero versus villain fight or whether it becomes a character study mm -hmm. it, it was not and it could not become a proper thriller as well have you have you seen the recent uh, Portozil? Portozil. Uh, Portozil. Uh, yeah, 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 and yeah, I saw. It's very cool and. Was, uh, what do you think of it? Uh, it's a uh, interesting movie where uh, it deals about uh, trauma kind of thing, like child mm -hmm. trauma in the beginning part, like how mm -hmm. uh, the situations or uh, the condition incline you towards the taking decision of being good and bad. Like due to parents' uh, upbringing, so it will make you like uh, to incline towards being good uh, by the officer as a role of an officer or being bad as a, a psycho killer. So not a psycho killer so, to uh, satisfy his uh, anger and to make himself calm, he needs to ch channelize his anger. So that uh, made him towards killing people. So it's an interesting movie as well.
I thought I thought it was a brilliant movie because um the 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 hero uh, the main guy uh the Ashok guy uh, he's he's always wearing earphones right in the beginning uh-huh. uh yeah. realize that this guy also probably went through some childhood trauma you're not exactly uh-huh. aware of what happened. uh but his father is missing when we first meet him mm. so well none of this is ex- explicitly told but by the time the end rolls in you mm. realize this guy also probably went through something similar uh. and but goes a better path mm. than uh, the uh, sharad babu's uh, character who uh. Uh, he he, I, he, looks, I, he looks damn cool bro in the villain role like uh, his skinny uh, tone and uh, क्या अनकोम्ड हेयर क्या ब्रुनेट नॉट ब्रुनेट सॉरी रेड हेयर द कॉम्बिनेशन एज वेल इट्स वेरी स्पूकी एंड हिज एक्शंस यस यस लवली आई लव्ड द फिल्म आई थॉट इट वाज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट दिस ईयर हां द मेन थिंग इज या देयर इज नो कॉमेडी इन इट देयर इज नो कॉमेडी इन इट देयर इज नो कॉमेडी एंड इट्स नॉट इट डजंट it doesn't serve you a bad dish like in the uh, fourth round so uh yeah i think the reason i i uh, i cited that movie was because uh, it also deals with a very complex prota- uh, antagonist right huh. but your protagonist is not as strong as your antagonist hmm. he is he has a philosophical conflict that goes against what the antagonist believes hmm. so you are rooting for your pro- protagonist over there over okay. here they uh, mahesh babu's character is set up so haphazardly hmm. and that your it comes when they start talking about sg surya and another thing i noticed is uh, in every crime genre movie a constant murder is happening like in a first scene and end scene there are constant murders and that that influence the main protagonist uh that that forces the protagonist to catch himself quickly as possible but if we see in the spider there is uh, no such thing as uh, urgency or emi- uh, the immediate action is uh, not required in the first half itself a consequence that the protagonist pays and now uh, if you remember in dark knight the uh-huh. joker uh, reveals that on one side is his girlfriend and on the other, on the other side, side is a uh, president kind of a uh, uh, thing role now uh, batman has had to make a choice who does he save uh-huh. and this he pays a price that bomb blast happens and uh, you know you know what happens after that i don't want to give spoilers for anyone who hasn't seen the dark knight but uh, oh, you know the dark knight it's a disrespect to people bro they must see they must respect a good movie they should they, it's a minimum responsibility of a people to acknowledge a good movie are like that uh-huh. Uh-huh. uh you have new listeners hmm. uh never let say that is uh, you look at mahesh babu's character there is one tiny scene where sj surya enters the house enters hmm. but they get saved there is nothing after that uh. he throw a rock mahesh babu saves it hmm. he uh, uh, completely tries to destroy a hospital mahesh babu kills him so hmm. mahesh is completely fine like he has no consequence there is nothing at stake for him uh. which is why don't you are not exactly caring you are, you care more for what is happening in sj surya's mind yeah uh, and the only part where uh, mahesh babu cries is that uh, first uh, reveal of a murder scene like where all body parts are someone else uh, i could not do, do we know the victims no. no do we know the victims and the protagonist no, no. Uh, it's a murder. yes but why will i care as yeah. as a viewer you look at poor tozel um the scene where they they trying to catch the guy this time huh? and when the the driver who was there all along says yeah. can you check if that water ah yeah yeah okay understood yeah, the, yeah. in the long grass fields where ha uh, huh. the actual murder has already taken place and it is the daughter of the driver ah yeah yeah so i understood, can... understood. ha yeah yeah ha under her pinky finger and then they check they check and it's the oh, yeah the identification scene character who has been with you has gone through so much so immediately you are invested you are like uh, how can this happen ha uh, in the first scene as well in the uh, if we take only the di- driver's character uh, first uh, being not uh, knowledge about the person he's dealing with 
he treats uh, he treats him as a normal person the officer and after he yes. uh, mentions that he is also a uh, part- partner of him so he immediately respects and uh, okay. from there uh, there are so many good things about him like he is uh, giving suggestions to him like uh, the decision on the- uh, and the murder happens this guy the like let's wait for a while they need to they are grieving but he says no sir it's our job we have to do it ha huh. so it goes and ask questions over there uh, so so to uh, so the conclusion is uh, if audience need to care about a, a character they must give something to us character has to pay a price why will yeah. i root for the uh, the character I, i want to see what is happening to that character why uh, something bad that happens huh. and that happens then i'm like okay now you go for it koi kotto ane a feeling raavali so so to me the mahesh babu cry in the spider movie is like a general character like in the metro scene when he's at the top so everyone is crying he is crying so i need a, a value that why he is crying i need the value of a tear of a drop so every okay. drop he sheds i need something like he must lose something so the person uh, he doesn't have it any credit where it's due i genuinely like the interval of spider save but you want <laughs> i i think i think at least as an idea it's very cool when uh, when sj surya is crying huh. and oh. his, it's a very cool idea huh. i like it what do you think of it ha uh, the same the metro scene right where he's killing his brother yes surya all of the metro pillars they uh. have bodies everyone that comes and he the iconic scene uh, the he's iconic scene where he's ha uh, where he takes his movement to enjoy the vibe he created like this is what i uh, prepared and uh, tried for to make and now it's happening so i am enjoying the movement right now he's in a calm state he's a peace state like i created the chaos i uh, i worked for it and it's paying now so the payoff scene is very cool for the villain but i need the sense of seriousness of the hero as well so exactly exactly uh, when he the... killed brother like from the top of the metro uh, under construction metro uh, i need a full close up of a hero that he he is taking the decision of killing his brother so hero is not uh, meant for killing anyone like uh, without any reason so okay, um if let's say mahesh babu's character had undergone something bad because of ah. sj surya brother hmm. now him the brother has more emotional way we are more rooting for ha uh-huh. so has a decision whether he kills or not he kills or not ah. sj surya not cannot shout cannot talk but does yeah, not want his brother he's to... cornered in the crowd like ha huh. if mahesh babu's character was given was given a little more um, back story on why he's chasing sj surya more personal story the interval scene would would have been peaks it would have been lovely uh-huh. yeah yeah but uh, generally when you're looking at the scene it's like he's fighting for justice which is a very cliched uh, cliched uh, the main Excuse. part is the surya's brother he ekado wonder mall lo uh, pan chestuntadu bro like why he, uh, hero wants to kill uh, surya's brother like uh, villain's brother he has no motive like uh, i see uh, they, they, uh, mahesh babu also did a crime now he is he is not doing the justice he is doing a crime i ekado wonder mall untadu why he needs to kill him so just to uh, demote the uh, villain he needs to kill i, I don't see it's a uh, good reason so instead of him if you take the movie of a, uh, in the movie uh, doctor when the twin brothers come in the metro he doesn't kill him he'll uh, uh, take the advantage of the their both love and he'll uh, take him into his own terms like uh, i'll kidnap him and uh, i will give you the rules and you follow so that which in doctor uh, these guys one of the twins they separate the twins ah uh, one of the twins dies the other twin comes and uh, causes chaos completely in, in the, the ending yeah, right yeah 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 in the island region as well so it is set up it is pay off that's it uh, uh, none of i wouldn't i would say that's that's an issue spider had as well you all your pay offs i have have no setup oh, absolutely i also no. i also want the hero to torture the uh, surya's brother not to kill but show him this is what you're doing to others like showing the villain that you are causing the pain 
and you are not understanding the pain so i will understand you the pain in the uh, jalsa movie bhayam <laughs> bhayam and like chubhi star like i want that scene bro in the spider like i want to show the villain uh, the uh, value of a pain a uh, value of a tear so if the scene comes in the spider if the any draft of the movie also like any bloopers also that shows that uh, hero wants to show the pain uh, want to understand and uh, teach the villain the pain it will be peaks bro like uh, i will watch rewatch the movie as well like i'll add the clip and i'll rewatch the movie at n times to so just a month i really hope uh, arm however Out of backlash after Spider. Haan. Uske baad bhai, I... Darbar, it's an another genre as well. It's... Yeah, wait, I'm just checking his filmography. Uh, I think he made Sarkar. Uh, Sarkar, right, with the Vijay Talapati. Uh, yeah, yeah, that was there. And then he made 2020, he made Darbar. Darbar. With, uh, Darbar also, the end concept is nice, but uh, the idea comes abruptly, bro. Like, Chalo, let's, uh, it's a concept of uh, all prisoners at uh, it's a Zoom meeting of all prisoners and let's find out who kills it. Right? Uh, who done it? Like, it's a good idea. There's no uh, con- constant uh, that suggestion that there is a concept uh, as uh, all prisoners in the jail comes and they uh, help uh, he, a police officer or hero to find that. Nothing abruptly. Like yeah, there is a solution to it. Like, uh, let's follow that. So, set up the uh, as well in the Darbar. I, uh, who uh, wrote Spider? Uh, it was written by ARM only, right? Um, huh. I'm just checking ARM. And he hasn't announced any film after Darbar. After Darbar, right. Huh. The director. I hope he gives a comeback. Uh-huh. So uh, the one thing I noticed is uh, he takes the logical part of a n or any Hollywood movie and he had an emotional to it like Gajni me. Uh, he takes the part of the uh, not the whole part I guess only the part where uh, uh, memory memory loss only the concept and he adds his own emotional touch like uh, his wife's death and the memory loss part and he'll make his own story like. Uh, anyone anyone who's seen Memento and seen Gajni huh. will tell you similar ideas, but they're very different films. Uh, I'm sorry. Screenplay of Memento is uh, next level, bro. Like, we need, you need to watch two times front, back. Like, we have to rewind the whole movie as well to uh, just understand what he's showing, bro. What's the timeline? It's 10, 12, it's 10, 15, it's 11 o'clock. It's uh, past. Uh, uh, screenplay is uh, horrendous in that uh, Memento. <laughs> but if it takes, but yeah, uh, Gajani, it's a very linear story, and it's it's, it's a proper revenge drama yeah, saga but, type, like huh. And you have the entire um, sequence with him and us in love story. It's a very I love that part. I love Gajani. Hmm. So songs and all, it's very uh, all this masala is mixed well, well mixed. Huh. So I with anyone who says Gajini and Memento are uh, same yeah similar. they're both two different movies but with same idea like okay the copy but True. he did something as well like he got some extra marks credits is uh, this this idea of saying that it's a copy it's a copy it's very easy to call yeah. things a copy yeah, to execute the copying part is very tough like huh what, what you're doing what is the emotion behind what you're doing it's mm. there's there's a lot or there's a lot of effort that goes in Simply looking at huh. Huh. <laughs> looking at two their similar ideas, it's a copy, it's very easy, and that's yeah. not how it works. It's huh. uh I think I hear a lot of those these days. Hmm. Oh okay, uh, and uh, let's start with the editing part. Can we Yes? Huh? So uh, we made something I want to make the podcast a little bit interesting. And uh, we choose that concept that let's uh, trim or edit the spider movie and let's chop the unnecessary part and uh, change the timeline as well. Like which part should come uh, ahead and which part should come after that, that setting payoff all that. 
so because uh, when i see uh, when i watched spider a quick a thought came that what if we come and in the starting scene in the spider what if we combine both the characters like uh, shots of the both characters like hero and villain like in one shot hero is saving one and in one shot he, uh, the villain is killing one like the uh, if we show the parallels how it will be like uh, the first one yeah uh, so uh, that thought made me so interesting and i want to make uh, the edit like which part and uh, the one uh, thing i noticed is Mm-hmm. in most south indian movies we give respect to a female lead too much like way too much way too much, way too much. like uh, we want a female lead uh, no matter what we want a female lead so why do you, why do you want a, a rakul preet singh character in spider movie just a phone call right it's just phone call that the last bomb is in the hospital so just to say this ho- one thing he made a whole unnecessary scenes puchaka scenes Uh, in the spider movie just for the pay of that he uh, she makes a call so any random call also will uh, pl- uh, play the role bro like uh, any staff in the hospital who wants to help the hero probably was in the hospital and he looked at uh, the but you could you could literally make that anything i i agree with uh, you i agree with you uh, so that part made me so annoying and irritating as well so that irks me a lot and the other part is that uh, tv serial ad Oh my god. Uh, there's no conviction bro. Enduko sundo they'll do like a TV switch just uh, Mahesh Babu oh come on come on uh, let uh, like add like aunties will climb the uh, uh, climb the buildings. Uh, I I uh, then I realized the Tamil director doing a movie. Ha huh. but uh, I saw the I mean I thought about the solution as well. So just addressing the problem is not the solution right? I have to think something I have to replace it so the oh. uh, solution part to uh, by me is uh, and the first scene he saves some people from any calls or it so what if we combine the setup and the payoff here so as he so gets him his parents are helping him in return like uh, he's doing uh, his parents are paying the favor like uh, he helped his uh, any uh, child uh, wife or something he helps so he takes the uh, advantage of it and he, the parents are paying off so it gives some respect and responsibility as well like why are why we are caring for the protagonist so if we if he combines both scenes like in the starting the helping scene and uh, paying back in the catching villain scene so if they That's add right. both it will give some weightage to the scenes like all endu chestunnar bro like uh, why she is climbing the whole pole he is uh, why they are connecting the whole speakers why so the reason is uh, just because of uh, ad and uh, reward so uh, that kind of disrespected uh, to me like it kind of disrespected a whole aunties category like they'll do any, they'll do anything for the ad i agree but they don't go to that extreme as well right so <laughs> yeah so uh, this thing that uh, atli does as well that uh, women empowerment in a wrong way scenes like in bigly football scenes like hyper ekdam kuch bhi karega main main udunga bicycle kick marunga last mein ki why bro like respect them as well. like uh, make some good scenes avan also has some uh... women uh, empowerment uh, i mean sharukh khan was tweeting about it yesterday so uh, so let's see elon to the <laughs> i i am i want jawan to be a good guy yeah go. see uh, i am pre designed bro like uh, i'll go to the movie i'll go to the jawan i'll boot for uh, every sharukh khan scenes every sharukh khan entry and i uh, like i believe there are many intro scenes of sharukh khan itself in a movie there are too many sharukh khans like two three sharukh khans at the moment at same time this is the same atli genre atli uh, design and i will cheer for it but when it comes to the female showing part i'll i'll take this uh, i'll take the back seat bro like either either like i hope it, uh, see uh, i mean i'm not that big a fan of bigil but i love uh, marcel 
I really enjoyed uh, Theri. Yeah. yeah, of course, Rajarani is not that. The thing is, Atli, I feel like he can handle bigger uh, productions. He yeah. Can, bigger uh-huh. movies. Trailer. So, that uh, one is very cool. Bro. Like the sh- cuts and songs placement, very interesting. And yeah, the female empowerment part that uh, I just hope it's not forced. It's it's yeah. uh, organic. <laughs> See, I am not a feminist, but uh, I I come under the uh, bracket of being misogyny uh, due to comedy and uh, being feminist for the respect. So I come between comedy and respect. So according to me, a uh, woman good empowerment scene is to not uh, recreate what uh, men do. Like mm-hmm. men can climb buildings, so why can't we? That's not woman empowerment, bro. Woman empowerment is a decision making, like. the emotional aspect and the decision making and how strong they are the uh, showing the respect of how strong they are so that is woman, woman empowerment like uh, dealing with the situation like uh, they are, they may face many hurdles but how they faced like not the physical aspects just the mental aspects they should show some good scenes i mean yeah like you said more about showing women to be independent and ability to take decisions by themselves right or wrong Hmm. they are the one of them doing what men do whether it is whatever see first of all what men do is all the things it's stupid and idiotic uh-huh. it's just chaotic and male testosterone levels bro like our testosterone uh, gives some chemicals and we perform there we don't have any uh, setup and pay off we don't have any so we just oh jay balaya we are that part bro so So yeah, I agreed. So women wanting to be more like men is not empowerment, and it's taking choices by themselves for whatever reason that is empowerment. Agreed. Yeah. So I just want to emphasize on the just decision making of women, like how they take decision. That shows the high level. We can create that much level in that scene also. So and before going to the next part, I just want to address the main er. illogical uh, decision in the jailer that a buddho de mo thod bro are <laughs> like in the first half the uh, rajnikanth case about him uh, like hell like uh, he'll do anything for him like he'll shoot a movie uh, the more love in the more chemistry between the grandson and the uh, grandfather so he will uh, give it ha uh-huh. had the entire thing it's just edit lo poyind adi uh the way that ramya krishna and this rajnikanth's family is not aware that this guy is alive rajnikanth mm-hmm. never tells them so they continue to live thinking that he's dead and in the end we all know what happens so they they edited it that way i'm sure i'm sure there must have been a better uh, better payoff huh. but the second have exceeded that's what i think it looked like uh, the, the main thing i love in the jailer is the ending like the hero wins but at what cost that concept like and the sofa laugh scene it's epic as well like uh, ha, 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 that top angle shot bro burra paada re re like it's very interesting that rajnikanth chose uh, to take that dark aspect in the movie kade nelson ki koncham freedom iste then uh, they could uh... he didn't take the control fully so being a star movie like star cast movie the main selling point is a mo- uh, hero and we uh, we should give some scenes to the audience to wood cheer so there are some boundaries where he didn't took the at long shot sekku bartha bro like doctor coco uh, cola like he take pauses too long like uh, unnecessary scenes he take the pause but that uh, adds the value he doesn't uh, I, i don't want to skip the part where he pauses for a long time मूव चाहिए ब्रो कैमरा स्टैटिक पड़ता है अंते लाइक द हीरोस मूव्स द कार मूव बट द कैमरा डेसन मूव ही जस्ट स्टॉप्स सो द स्क्रीन प्ले एंड द डायरेक्शन इज इंटरेस्टिंग द वे ऑफ कैमरा वेयर टू प्ले बिकॉज सम सीन्स देयर आर सो मेनी कैरेक्टर्स ईच ऑफ देम विद देयर ओन बट द कैमरा वंडरफुली ब्लॉक्ड एंड द कैरेक्टर्स आर सो 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 वेल कोऑर्डिनेटेड एंड स्टेज्ड आई Since, uh, strength hmm. so okay uh, let's wrap this part and uh, let's jump into this new section that uh, actually <laughs> due to uh, some my laziness 
I didn't download the movie. <laughs> Let's go into the pirated movie. I do. Actually, I support kind of support pirated movies. With uh, it's a controversial opinion, but I support bro. Like if the whole good quality is uh, available to me as a free part, why can't I opt it? Like being selfish, the devil part inside me always says that. Chur bro, a my bro. Like okay. Want people to know which websites I'm using to watch movies. I'm watching very legally, guys. Only Kasim is doing illegal stuff. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> be illegal, bro. Be bindas. No repercussion, no consequences. Just do the act. Bagad with the jeopard, bro. Like do the act. Don't think about any consequences. <laughs> and just follow like Jay Krishna, bro. Jay Balai, Jay Krishna. you should be you should be correct and you should watch things legally okay not on uh, movie rolls quid dot net uh, one to three movies no don't use those okay oh, okay bro like 1000 rupees for prime video pay 399 for sony live pay ne ne la if i have the subscription as well like if i have netflix if i have prime m i have prime videos even if i have netflix i'll still prefer in the hura watch and the movie rules one to three bro like addict to kya mai like pura isme so anything i watch diet movies 1 2 3 <laughs> movie rules 1 2 3 uh, click karo naya movie dekho fir kya tum enjoy <laughs> so so let's start this movie aspect 10 so minutes let, parwani lesson let's make this uh, part 2 right the cutting editing part if you wish yeah, sure we'll do part 2 where we we'll edit the film so part 2 in the next part the like editing part Uh, the, okay, this time I'll download the movie. I'll separate the clips. We'll give it a name. We'll rearrange the scenes if possible. What 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 I did here is. Ready, download it and pay ninety nine rupees. Buy it on YouTube. A uh, Prime lo edit chalem bro. Prime lo download just edit chalem bro. It stays in the Prime only. Okay. Ye do. Ha. Eagle. I'll ask Murda to send his copy, first copy. I'll give him pen drive. Edit just some bro. Like uh, we'll edit the clips and we'll rearrange the scenes. Like which scene must come first. And the first thing is we'll chop off the song scenes where it is Done. necessary, bro. Like awesome. Like the endu kundi. Like I want this uh, scenes like uh, serious scenes, like constant as uh, a sequences uh, of serious scenes. మధ్యలోనే పుచ్చకాయ పుచ్చకాయ లైక్ వై పుచ్చకాయ బ్రో లైక్ ఎనీ ఎనీ అదర్ ఫ్రూట్ ఆల్సో ఇట్ వర్క్ బట్ పుచ్చకాయ డజన్ వర్క్ ఫర్ మీ సో లెట్స్ చాప్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ ద సాంగ్స్ అండ్ ద సేమ్ ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఓకే ద ఓన్లీ ద పాయింట్ జస్ట్ రియలైజ్ ఈస్ ద సేమ్ పాయింట్ కమ్స్ ఇన్ ద ఖలేజా యాజ్ వెల్ ద సేమ్ సూపర్ హీరో ఆర్ ద సేమ్ మహేష్ బాబు జాన్రా ఇన్ ద ఎక్స్పెరిమెంటల్ పార్ట్ పాళ్ళిలో ఎక్కడో ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఉంది so at the starting part he'll mention some problem in the pali and he'll never address the problem of the pali until the interval scene the same happens in the spider as well there is no addressing of the villain or the uh, murdering problem part in the movie until the interval scene at the time pass akkada time pass cheyalante heroine kavali ha heroine uh, that uh, double meaning scenes not double meaning his showing that only the meaning ha so nega da friends with benefits ha ma pe ha that talk ha asal endu pettado just because of the presence of heroine we have to no i don't think bro just don't give respect to women bro <laughs> be little misogyny in choosing the art like take the woman part if needed like if you want knowing that the woman is her only life goal is the man huh. her only world is the then being misogynistic ha huh. be bro like tise rakul prithvi tise movie nundi like make a new version uh, we want the snider cut if, of the spider movie as well like where we don't need any scenes of rakul prithvi just ma- uh, make new scenes and reshoot it again we'll watch bro like ipu trend to nadustundi ka like uh, rewatching like uh, what's the trend now uh ha re release yeah re release stuff so re release spider with the new cut 
where only the serious part of the movie comes and a wonder mall scene could tease bro like the full three, uh, cg stuff of the roller coaster ride we can cut it off like we can that that skip to the metro scene while he, uh, holding the surya uh, villain's brother so we can just chop it off bro like just the sake of the hero movie elevation scene cut it bro like snyder cut kuda adhe kada like being the superhero as well superman batman any flash or anything still the movie is flop and the snyder cut hits different due to this flop so uh, we uh, we want the re-release of this spider with new cuts as well like full, i am, in, I am a... full dra- draft draft anta ekki chese bro like the uh, uh, bloopers as well add it just remove rakul preet singh scenes and add the bloopers where, where there's just a hero laughs at some mistake comedy and then just some bro rakul preet singh in why <laughs> why am i caring for a heroine in the movie but in the batman it gives the ad like choosing the decision part it give uh, it adds some stakes to the main conflict but in the this movie like spider just randomly puchaka kosam rakul pitin iskunnadu bro like why so be aware be misogynist uh, see be misogynist bro directors of new generation like if you take this uh, uh, lokesh okka female lead led bro inka like uh, 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 excluding the tina agent tina there are no female leads and that makes the movie more masculine and more strong so if uh, the story demands a strong human uh, like a strong, a strong being of a strong man don't cast any uh, female leads like odle se avasaram ledu like we don't need women like being a man we don't need women just to uh, satisfy our uh, chemicals chemical reaction we don't need women bro just masculine rage like testosterone level anything like full so that being the comedy part of being me misogynist so uh, he has a conclusion part of me the only suggestion part in any movie any tollywood movie don't cast heroines all emo problem undi bro heroines ki like um, uh, we don't cast we don't get paid don't give money bro don't cast him uh, don't cast itself like make a female lord like anushka uh, uh, anushka shetty is uh, 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 adedi uh, arundhati so the, if there are any uh, role to play to show the women empowerment scenes then cast bro nahi to no don't need if hero gets a scene of uh, being uh, like uh, good, uh, showing the good part of the uh, showing the good role why can't a hero as well so show uh, like i want a scenes where uh, uh heroine takes a decision and it impacts holy the katana impacts in poorthana also the she's not a heroine but a female lead uh, she inspires uh, the protagonist to be still oh, be she, to take the uh, right decision and it comes right it uh, the guy targets her ha targets her the, so there is stake in it so give some stakes to heroine that give some weightage her uh, main point is so let's uh, wrap up the video ha uh, okay uh, so let's wrap up the video so cool 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 Ooh. bye bye